But we're gonna watch a documentary about New Orleans now. Heyo, good morning. I am up, it is five in the morning, and I am leaving. This is all my stuff, bag, camera, backpack, and I'm dressed up more than I usually am. And we're heading out, and by we I mean me. I've got an hour and a half to drive this morning, and then we gotta meet up at the bus, and then we're driving to Kansas City today. So that'll be fun. I did not sleep very much last night. I went to bed. I should have gotten four hours of sleep, but I could not sleep for the last hour. But I had to get up for the bathroom, and then I was like, mm, I can't sleep. I tried. I really did. Ooh. All right, time to go. Okay, we have made the first stop. We have met the bus, so I am done driving. And we are going to be heading out, picking up six more people, and then we're headed to Kansas City. Yeah. I honestly don't know if I will record too much today because I'm working, I guess. All right, we just stopped for lunch. I ate Panera, got myself a bread bowl with some broccoli and cheddar uh, soup in it. And it was delicious, and everything is going well. I have 10 people, and Everyone seems to be content. We, we've been watching live country concerts. I don't know, we're gonna watch a documentary about New Orleans now. Just made a quick stop at McDonald's. We've got about an hour left and then we will be in Kansas City. Yeah, we're almost there. We just got done watching a documentary about New Orleans, Narlins. It was really frustrating though because the movie would not play in order. And so every time the chapter like skips to the next one, it would be some like random chapter and so we just kept playing random chapters because it was like a documentary so it didn't really matter if it was in order or not. It would have been helpful, but we made it work. We all made it to Kansas City. How awesome is that? Nobody got lost. I made sure we had everyone here and now I'm in my room. I'm going to go downstairs. They're having a social hour. I also ripped ugh, my shirt already. Granted, it was only like $5 from Goodwill, but sad day. I'm gonna go meet the other half of the group, and whew, I don't know. I need to, I need to sleep. I'm tired. It's a long day, a lot of driving. I was just debriefing my boss about my half of the trip, and he's telling me about his, and he nonchalantly said that I could potentially run this trip next year. So I'm like, uh, right? Like, yeah, maybe I can do that. And I don't know, I don't really want to commit to it right now because I do want to find a full-time graphic design position. That is what I ultimately would like to do. But it's kind of tempting, a little bit tempting. And I don't know. <clears throat> so I guess I'm going to lead a little bit more of this trip, which is not really what I expected, but eh, that's not that hard to do. And he's already planned everything. I just got back from dinner. I had a Caesar salad, a chicken Caesar salad. It was delicious. But while I was at dinner, I looked at my email and I had a, what's it called, repeated charge on my credit card. And so I looked at it and it was two $100 transactions for Sears. And I was like, that's weird, I never go to Sears. So I signed on to my account and I have four $100 transactions to Sears and none of them are mine. So I just got back, I just got off the phone with my credit card company and I talked to some girl named Ava who was really nice but I could barely understand her because her English was very broken. And the other problem is that I'm traveling right now, and so they're, they canceled my card, they're sending me a new one, they're sending me some sort of fraudulent letter that I need to fill out. I'm hoping that it'll be good when I get back in 10 days. I, ugh, God, that's frustrating. So now I don't have a credit card. I got my debit card still, but uh, who is buying things at Sears with my card? That is not okay. Anyway, I am back in my room. I'm, well, I'm in the hallway right now talking on the phone, but... I think I'm going to call my dad, give him an update because he wants to know what's going on, and then I'm probably going to bed. So, like this video, give it a thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe to my channel, and you will see me tomorrow. This town is full of Jesus, Christmas, and patriotism. Carol's raising her hand like she wants the waiter or something.